Hello, welcome to our fifth grade lesson, Division Patterns with Decimals. So we're trying to figure out what A could be here. So we want to look at the pattern that's happening. And, and look at this. So if we do 375 divided by 10 to the first power, or 375 divided by 10, what do we do? So we move the decimal one spot from uh, 375 to become 37.5. Here, 375 divided by 10 squared, or 375 divided by 100. What are we doing? We're moving one, two spots, as in like 10 to the second power. We're moving the decimal two spots. Down here with 10 to the fourth, when we do 375 divided by 10 to the fourth power, we're moving the decimal one two, three, four spots. So what do you think? Let's complete the pattern. What's going to happen if we have a, we start with 375 and we're going to move it three spots. One, two, three. So what we're looking for, 375 divided by 10 to the third power, in other words, 375 divided by 1,000 is going to be 0 0.375. Question two. This asks it a little bit uh, of a different way. <laughs> it should be relatively straightforward to see the pattern one, blank, three, four. So I'm guessing that A would be probably two, just looking at the pattern. But take a minute to think about it, right? So uh, here we move the decimal one spot. Down here we moved it one, two, three spots. Here, one, two, three, four spots. So 10 to the first power, move it once. 10 to the third power, move it three times. 10 to the fourth power, we move it four, th four times. So what are we doing? We're moving the decimal two spots. So really what we're doing is we're doing 785 divided by 10 squared. And that power that we're looking for is two. All right, question three. What is A? So if we do... 52 divided by 10 to the third power, or 52 divided by 1,000, what are we doing again? So think about this. Remember, we're gonna, the pattern we found is that whatever pattern of how many, uh, the power is how many spots that we're going to move the decimal. So if we move it one, two, three spots, okay, zero for the placeholder here, so it's 0 0.052. Now, what would that give us? So if we had 52 divided by 1,000, we'd be looking at 0 0.052. This question asks it uh, slightly differently again. So if we're given 795 divided by 10,000. So 10,000, right? So if we go back a second, 10 to the third power would be like 10 times 10 times 10, or 1,000, okay? So how many zeros? Three zeros, three. So 10,000, that would be like 10 to the fourth power, okay? So we're gonna actually, so if we're doing 795 divided by 10,000, then we wanna move this decimal over. One, two, three, four spots. Okay, so we're looking for 0 0.0795. And finally, what is A? Okay, so we have a number that was divided by 1,000 to give us 0 0.12. So if we put this back in the exponential form, so three zeros here, or 1,000, that would be like, okay, 10 to the first power is 10. 10 to the second power would be 100. 10 times 10 times 10 would be our 1,000 that we're looking for, okay? So the power of the 10 is how many spots we're moving the decimal. Now, in this case, 0 0.12 was after we divided by 1,000. So we're actually going to, instead of moving it to the left, what we have, and move it to the right. One, two, three spots. 
and that would give us 120. So 120 divided by 1,000 gives us our 0 0.12. Okay, great job, everyone, and have an awesome day.